Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and uh, this is a quick uh, video for those that are using the stable version of Microsoft Edge. Since the last update, um, an increasing number of people have actually mentioned that they have a problem with the stable version of Edge uh, playing YouTube videos. So apparently what happens is you start playing YouTube videos and at some point the browser will crash. Microsoft has acknowledged that there is indeed a problem with YouTube playback on Microsoft Edge browser and that they are working on a fix. So just be patient until the next version of the stable uh, Edge is, working, is going to be uh, released. This should be fixed. One of the things that they are mentioning for those that still want to use Edge is you can actually temporarily download one of the Insider Edge uh, versions so that the Dev Channel or the Canary Channel or Beta Channel Edge, that will work and actually will work temporarily as a replacement. So you can use that browser uh, until this one is actually fixed. So this is um, kind of funny because, I mean, you know, one of the things that you want in these products is to have as much stability, especially when it's called the stable channel. What is even funnier is I have less problems on the Dev and Canary channel with my uh, Edge browser than I do with the stable one, which is kind of uh, a weird thing when you think about it. So anybody out there that has Microsoft Edge stable uses that as your browser and noticed that there are crashes on YouTube. Microsoft working on a fix. It doesn't seem to affect everybody. I've tried here to view a few YouTube videos just to see. I didn't have any crashes as of yet. Maybe it's not every time you watch a video. Maybe it's just from time to time. But uh, for now, I haven't seen anything that um, crashes mine. But it could be, uh, you know, hardware related. It could be something about uh, hardware acceleration, the way it works, depending on the type of hardware you have. So uh, there were some people that actually suggested a few little things to turn off hardware like acceleration, stuff like that. But uh, most of what I've seen doesn't seem to work for the most part. So just hang in there and um, it should be fixed eventually if you are one of those that is affected by this problem. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.